maybe someday I could hire a running shoe giveaway manager. That would be amazing. If we keep trending in this direction, it just might happen. That's right, Wednesday, July 17th, today. If you're watching this on the day this blog publishes, tonight, 7 p.m. Mountain Time is the next live stream in the studio. And yes, it's gonna be a running shoe giveaway version, okay? We do a lot of lives, I can't believe, so the YouTube channel was unable to live stream for three months. How, where does the, I can't believe it's been three months. That's insane, it's amazing that it's back. And so what I'm gonna do now is get organized. I gotta use, so we have a, a carport that we've con converted into a patio sitting area. We've got a big table, and my task now is to get organized and ready for the giveaway so that it can run smoothly. And I can promise you, I promise, we're gonna do at least, oh my goodness, oh man, at, at least 20 shoes, okay, 20 pairs. Now, sometimes, usually we only do like 10 to 12. Uh, but we're becoming more efficient in our giveaways and also because of your generosity. So just so you know, these shoes are gently used. Some of them are brand new and they're sent to me, to my PO box from viewers out there literally around the world. I must say, probably the leading country right now absolutely is Australia sending me shoes. Thank you so much and everyone who has sent shoes for those who truly, truly need them. So anyway, Mark your, mark your calendars, it's tonight, and if you could, invite your friends, especially those that need running shoes, or, and they're like cross country, and I keep saying this, but cross country practice is probably starting up right about now for high schoolers, not only across the United States, but around the world. And so if you could let them know if they need help getting some new shoes, now of course not everyone can win, but you gotta show up to at least try. You know what I mean? All right. Let's get organized. Here we go. Oh man, boxes upon boxes. These arrived from Rhode Island this week. Oh yeah, all right. Going out here. One thing is for certain, I need to go get all the shoes that are in my closet in order to open up space inside the house and then I'll focus on everything out here in the studio. All right, come on inside. Brand, brand new Skechers, Adidas. There's my boot. Gosh, more Skechers. Packing tape for the shipping, which I'll update you at the live stream how we're gonna do that. I need a warehouse. I need a warehouse. I'm excited. This is good. We need a warehouse. YouTube family, let's do this. Oh my goodness. This is just beautiful. Oh. I don't even know what to say right now. My, this is just my closet, not the studio. Oh boy. Oh boy, ladies and gentlemen. Oh. All right, everyone. <laughs> I'm gonna pause the organization for the giveaway. I gotta go get my run in and then go to the gym. So I'm gonna pause, we'll come back later tonight. We'll lay it all out, get it organized, get a nice thumbnail for the live stream and proceed from there. Oh man, I'm uh, literally speechless. Jeez, all right. Ultra Paradigm 4.5, first impressions, publishing at five. Let's do this just because can't resist, can't resist. Gonna open up a box for you here in a minute once we get to the running location. Oh man, I just can't, I can't wait till tomorrow, I guess tonight for you guys. All right, let's roll. Forgot everyone. Oh man, so it's finally hot in Denver. It's 97 today, which I know is not very hot for many locales around the world, uh, but it's pretty warm for Denver. So this Halo 
headband. It's a lifesaver. It keeps the sweat out of your eyes and I love it. So you basically you just put it on like this and I haven't used it all summer because I was injured and it wasn't very hot but now it's in July and it's finally hot in Denver so I do that and then either the hat backward or forward depending on how intense the sun is that day and it just keeps the sweat and I know you look a little crazy a little ridiculous but uh, it keeps the sweat out of your eyes and if you live in a humid climate it's not very humid in Denver, but if you live in a humid climate, this is the money shot. Um, I can't believe I just remembered now to start using it again during these hot summer months. So there you go, just like that. Boom, bada bang. So anyway, this, I love it. I just love it. And it's, it's, it's almost my favorite piece of running gear for the summertime because I, I, I can't stand when sweat gets in my eyes. All right, let's lace up. Here we go. Ultra Paradigm 4.5 a stability shoe, all right, stability shoe. Let's do this. All right, got the box. I did not forget, although it was close. Here we go. Let's see, shout out to Gabriel in New Hampshire. You rock, Gabriel. Thank you for helping others out by getting a good pair of running shoes on their feet. All right, let's see what it is. Come on here. These will be given away tonight. In fact, I'll just say it now. We'll do these first tonight at 7 p.m. All right. Oh boy, I see a blue box. You know what that means. Brooks in the house, but sometimes it's not Brooks. It's not, sometimes it's not the running shoe that is in the box. All right, let's see what they are. Boom, boom. Uh-oh, let me go grab that. Oh, oh, nice. Brooks, this is a trail shoe. What is this, the Pure Grit from Brooks? Oh man, that's looking real nice. A trail shoe, I do believe. Okay, I'm not as familiar with this. Let me just make sure here. All right, I'm just gonna say it. Nine and a half, nine and a half men's uh, UK, eight and a half Europe 43. Brooks Pure Grit, that's looking real nice. Looks brand new. I mean, it doesn't even look like it's been worn at all. So good work, thank you, Gabriel. Shout out to you. This is amazing. All right, I'm gonna go grab that piece of paper. Oh, it is. Hey Seth, YouTube fan here. Purchased these pair of running shoes, but they fit a bit small. Hope they end up in the hand of someone who could use them. Gabriel, they will, Gabriel. You're the best. Thank you so much. All right, first pair of shoes given away tonight. No, no sweat in the eyes today. All right, I'm gonna do my, my hopping, my one-legged hopping up this little hill and then uh, four strides. I want to go barefoot soon, but it's not quite time yet. That may be next week. I think next week I'll be ready. So let's get that hopping on. And away we go with strides. Oh, ah, the run was fine. The strides were excellent. I just haven't been able to do that type of turnover with my legs since early April, since the injury. So it just feels so good to be able to move again at a faster clip. And that is the baby step before workouts. If I can do strides, probably three, three different sessions of strides, I will feel confident enough to be able to start mixing in workouts once again. And I did them in the Ultra Paradigm 4.5s, a very heavy shoe. And yes, my first impressions will be later today at 5 p.m. Uh, but nonetheless, I still was able to do it on that grass there. So that was good. And we're going to go with give for the keyword because you guys out there, and if I ever, I just want to make sure I'm clear. The running shoe giveaways, I never want to say I, it's all about we, because I'm simply a bridge between your generosity and these people that need running shoes, okay? So that's that's the bridge here. Maybe the, oh no, we'll, we'll stick with give. I almost said, I almost made it an audible to a bridge as the keyword, but we'll stick with give because you all are giving out of your generosity for others. And yes, 7 p.m. tonight, Wednesday, July 17th. It's gonna be fun. Um, and what else on that? I think that's it. Did I, okay, did I, it's been a long day. It's been a hot day. Sometimes the heat kind of gets to me. Um, did I ask a question of the day already? I frankly don't even remember. So if I haven't, we're gonna get a little vulnerable here. Um, and I'm just not afraid to share that as a 31, 32 year old, I was struggling to buy running shoes. Uh, so this is a pair of shoes, the Hoka Claytons. 
that I bought off of Craigslist for $20. Because the, the family and I, we were just in a tough spot. And that's what families do, right? We help each other out. And that's what this YouTube family is doing once again through your generosity. So the question of the day, have you been in a tough spot before where you need help buying something, but let's hone in on running shoes. Like I know that's some, it can be a small purchase for a lot of people, but for others, it can be a big purchase. And this is just the reality of being a human being. Like there's highs and lows on this, on this earth. Okay. So I had a little bit of a low two years ago and I had to buy. <laughs> and now look, now look like it's like there's shoes everywhere because a lot of things, you know, hard work, right? And just patience and persistence and believing in the cause at hand. And so I'm just excited. Anyway, if you feel comfortable answering that question, the question of the day, feel free to chime in down below. I'll just be very transparent with all of you. I've been in tough positions before financially where I could not buy shoes. Okay, I'm happen hopping out on the patio to wrap up the organizing of the shoes. And then we are going to edit and go to bed because it's going to be a big day tomorrow. All right. Seek beauty. Actually, wait, we'll save that. We'll save that. Come out to the studio. Okay. I'm so excited. So the first shoes we're going to give away are from Gabriel from New Hampshire, the second and third pair. So ladies, I apologize. We don't have as many ladies shoes compared to the men's shoes, but the second and third pairs will be these Brooks. What are these? Oh, I don't even know, but two pairs of Brooks for ladies, they will be for you. So make sure you're there early. And I just thank you for sending ladies, shoe because, ladies shoes because we just don't quite have as many, but we'll continue to build up the, uh, the stable of running shoes here. So look at all this, it's amazing. All right, that's it for today. Thanks for being here, thanks for watching. Seek beauty, work hard, and love each other. See you tomorrow. See you at seven, see you at seven.